Many of you have asked me this question in the comment section that how to install packages uh, in R. And this tutorial is basically for uh, beginners uh, of R programming, those who are just starting out uh, with R programming. So I'll just show you how to uh, install uh, packages uh, in R. Some of you have asked me, so you know, I'm just quickly making a short tutorial on this. So you can uh, install uh, packages in R in two ways, basically in two ways. Um, so let me uh, show you how to do by typing in the command. So you just type in uh, install that uh, packages and then you know provide the name of the package. Okay. Uh, let's uh, we do not know the name of the package. So uh, we just keep it blank. So you know we can essentially put uh, the name of the package with a double quote. But uh, since we do not know the package name, let's just keep it blank and then let's do enter okay so it's the packages okay now it's going to uh, you know there's there is going to be a prompt which will ask us that uh, choose the cran mirror so this is nothing but uh, the location of the server from where we uh, would like to download uh, the package now you will have uh, you know several of these locations uh, from many different countries uh, you will uh, you, you should uh, go ahead uh, with selecting the one that is very closest uh, to you. So uh, since I'm in UK, so I can you know choose something from uh, one from UK. So I can choose Cambridge, London. So I'll go with Cambridge. So once uh, we have you know selected uh, the location of the server from where we want to uh, install the package. The next prompt that is going to show it to us is the packages names. Okay, so now that we have the list of packages, you know, it's uh, in, in uh, um, order, sorted in order. So we can, you know, um, we can just find it out uh, that which uh, which package do we want to we want. And um, there's so many of them over 5000. That's what uh, that's what I know. Uh, and it, it is increasing uh, ever increasing. Uh, with time um, because many people are contributing towards uh, the um, R open source um, libraries. So let's um, let's install any of these packages. We can you know let's install gquad. Um, all right. Okay, maybe we can install grammar. Okay. So we just select that and just press OK and it is going to install. Now uh, you can uh, install. Uh, you just have to. So what it's, it's doing is that it is uh, it is downloading from the uh, in, you know the from CRAN. Many of these uh, um, many of these packages uh, which got downloaded are from CRAN, uh, which is the official place where you know you can. Download R and R packages. So that's the website where you can you can find. Okay, it's, it's still the case. Okay, now that the download process is over, you can uh, load the package that you have um, that you have just uh, you know installed. Okay, so for that you just have to write library, and then what is that? G That's what, right? So library, and then provide the name of the package, and that's going to, you know, uh, install for you. Okay. So I have another uh, package I've already installed. So I'll just show you to go ggplot to have just installed. So when I uh, want to load it, yeah. So now it's uh, it got loaded uh, onto a sources uh, on your onto your R session. Now you can use it, uh, you know, for different uh, purposes now for gplot you can use it to plot uh, your data um, if you want to get uh, more help um, about installation you just have to type in help and then packages okay okay now it is going to take you to the internet and you will get um, you know different uh, informations about loading uh, R packages. Um, 
So if you want to learn more about it, so there is a page dedicated on uh, the CRAN website. You can uh, read it thoroughly to get more information about how to, you know, uh, load packages in different forms. All right. So if you want to know what are the different packages available uh, in R, just you know, type in packages in R in the first uh, URL itself. Uh, you will find the CRAN website where. It has got the list of packages available to you and you can just uh, select as for your uh, you know requirement so the uh, description of each one of these packages what exactly a particular package does is given uh, in this list um, all right and you can also get uh, many of these packages in R studio if you're using R studio then this is where you can get the details of the packages Second way of doing it is uh, using the menu bar. So we have got package. So first you, you need to do what uh, is just installation of package. So that's the first step. So when you try to install a package, it's going to again do the same. It will ask us uh, to choose the server. Given that we have already uh, selected the server from where we want to download the packages, that's not going to prompt again. But uh, otherwise it is going to prompt you. You know, and uh, select the one that is closest to you, and it's going to give us the list of packages you want to install. You know, just select any one of these packages you want to install, and it is going to install for you. Uh, once that is done, uh, the next step is, of course, loading the package for use, and that also you can do. Okay, now it uh, successfully got successfully got installed. So next step is to load the package. So when you load it, you will be given the list of packages which are already uh, uh, sort of installed in your system. So all you need to do is just uh, select the one that you want to, uh, you know, load onto uh, onto the R session. Select the one and just press OK, and that's going to, uh, you know, load for you. Okay, so that's a very small tutorial on uh, installing packages on 